Caballeros y caballeros, Señor Arroz here. Ladies and gentlemen, you already have Netflix on your phone. I know you do. Some of you have it on your PlayStation, you have it on your smart TV, your computer. Um, and with Netflix comes a great way to learn even more Spanish. Get ready. This is a special challenge going out to all of you students, high school, college, teachers, professors, you too. Anybody could benefit from this. Here's the challenge. I want you to turn on the Spanish language subtitles on the next thing you watch, the next, uh, the next movie, the next film, something like that. Have a pen and paper ready. Uh, you hear a phrase, it's translated into Spanish, you write it down, or if you don't want to write it down, hey, pause the screen, take a picture, something like that, you will learn a ton. Ladies and gentlemen, I can't take all the credit for this. You know who got me started? My greatest teacher of Spanish in high school, Pablo. Pablo, if you are watching right now, two thumbs up, kudos to you. One thing we used to do in class, we used to watch some movies and he used to, he actually bought some video cassettes of films that had the subtitles, Spanish language subtitles in them. Okay, now that was the 90s. Notice I said video cassettes. Ladies and gentlemen, you are in a better position than I was, than Pablo's class was at the time. Because, ladies and gentlemen, you've got DVDs and Blu-rays. Basically, any movie that you own, Go to the options, you can turn on the subtitles in Spanish. Okay, Netflix, same thing, go to options, settings, uh, find it in there and turn on those Spanish language subtitles. Now what's the benefit guys? These translations, they're pretty darn good. Now here's the thing, they are translating what? They're translating, you know, dialogues between characters, movie dialogues, and basically movies, you know, the dialogue is pretty authentic to the way that we talk. So ladies and gentlemen, you're going to hear a lot of daily talk, conversation, the kind of thing that you're not going to find in instructional textbooks. Sure, you'll find some of that, but all, but all this daily talk, the way we and you know, not so academic the way we talk. I mean, there just simply isn't an instructional book that could that could hold all these lines, all this dialogue. I mean, how big, how thick would this book be, and what would it cost? Okay, I mean, it, it's outrageous to uh, to even imagine that. So you have a tool right there in your phone, on your smart uh, in, on your smart TV, on your computer. You got Netflix. You probably have a collection of DVDs and or Blu-rays. I challenge you. Turn on the Spanish subtitles for the next movie, the next show you want, um, you watch, sorry. Um, you will learn a ton. You will learn a ton, ladies and gentlemen. I've been doing it for years. I still do it. That's my challenge to you. In the comments down below, if you come across anything interesting in a film that you, that you were like, hey, that translation really... Uh, that was really good. I've always kind of wondered how to say that in Spanish and that movie translation gave it to me. Something like that. Uh, please leave something in the comments down below. But above all things, take my advice and do this. I'll see you in the next video. In the meantime, ladies and gentlemen, gracias por escuchar. Gracias por mirar. He dicho.